Larry Denby started volunteering at St. Vincent de Paul's Human Services Dining Room about two years ago. I wanted to give back. I mean, I've been homeless on and off, and St. Vincent de Paul has always been there. Denby started out serving coffee and now helps out in several ways. And just about anything else that needs to be done around here. I'm the uh, all over person. Food kitchens like St. Vincent de Paul's help alleviate the issue of homelessness by providing food for those in need. They also help provide temporary shelter during bad weather. Everybody wants to be in some place where it's warm. So that's our busiest. In 2017, volunteers and outreach workers counted over 5,000 homeless people on the streets or in shelters in a single day. 37% of homeless people in Maricopa County are in families. I've made a lot of friends. People I don't even know say hello to me here and there. So it's like, I must be doing something like they actually remember my name. Jeffrey Dryden is another one of St. Vincent de Paul's volunteers. He helps out anywhere he's needed, but mostly works in the garden. I really never liked gardening, but I do now. It's physical labor, and I need to get dirty. Dryden is looking for a nearby apartment, as well as a job in engineering at the VA hospital. Larry Denby has plans, too. I'm going to continue volunteering with St. Vincent de Paul and uh, eventually get into an apartment again forever. <laughs> the best remedy for homelessness is charity toward the people it affects. We're like uh, a family member. Reporting for Cronkite News, I'm Mark McCrow. Yeah.